Hello, and welcome to another fun-filled Sunday. Fuck off, asshole! Leave me alone! Don't you know it's fucking Sunday? sounds to make a new theme song and for today we're going to continue going through the reactor user library um, blog one of the latest blogs dark techno ensembles and i'll include a link to uh, this blog in the description of the video as well we've been through the mean machine uh, the dfam mm, sad face uh, it's not around anymore see previous episodes you'll find out why um and most recently the can to back this thing was a beast and we just barely scratched the surface on that guy so i encourage you to check it out but for today what we're gonna do is go over pitch kick hard styles intentionally a kick drum generator for side trance and progressive trance and minimal techno pitch kick turns into a full-blown gabber machine when using the additional b panels audio shaper for extra punch heavy saturation i like it i like the sound of it already as it's quite a basic tool it's recommended to sample the generated kick and reuse it in a sample in order to gain more control over the kick drum sound interesting recommendation um, so at any rate, we're going to check the pitch kick and check this guy out here. So let's see, uh, let's go ahead and download this and, um, we'll go ahead and get this worked into my library. So let's go ahead and get my downloads folder open. Let's go ahead and get my documents folder open and navigate to my reactor ensembles library and then we'll open up pitch kick we'll see what we got in the folder sign beats version 1.1 2.1 and 3 pitch kick previously sign beats uh specialized pitch kick drum generator so, uh, and then, yeah, we have the Pitch Kick ISM version 3. So, we'll just go ahead and copy version 3. We actually don't need, in my view, we don't need version 2 or 1. I mean, I, I suppose they're cool. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'd rather just keep the latest version. Ah, uh, let's just copy them in. They're not really that. I mean, come on, 4.7 megs. They're not really that expensive in terms of how much space they take up so let's go ahead and get them in there who cares and then uh instruments let's go ahead and get the instrument version of this in here as well and then pitch kick that is it we are integrated in so now that we're integrated in let's go ahead and play and uh we recently have the can do back that's what's open, but uh, we're not going to play with that for today. We're going to play with this new, uh, this new ensemble that we just downloaded called Pitch Kick, and it's going to be called Sign Beats. Uh, when you're when you're browsing for it, so when you get to your library, you know, make sure you open Sign Beats. That's what you're looking for. Um, but we're going to go ahead and let's see about resizing. Let's see. That looks not bad. Oh, no way. That sounds so fucking good. Oh, that's 
that's cool. This is like a four second, a 3.3 second release time. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's amazing. And I guess if you flip over to the B, it says there are additional controls. So envelope the depth, try square, try attack. And there's all sorts of sounds, just a distorted filter, shaper. Man, this thing is a beast. The volume doesn't matter as much because we'll just fix it in post, obviously, as we always tend to do with these unexpected volumes. Man! What can I say about this thing? It's awesome. It seemed to be starting out in the 20s in terms of... Uh, you know, in terms of um, presets. Oh. That's what would be cool is uh, it would be interesting to sample this inside of a machine or some Ableton or something and and start using this, uh, you know, in a sequenced way. Oh, man, all these sounds so good. So it seems there's like an attack section, there's a tail section, which to me is two oscillators. That's what I think it is anyway. A short one is meant to be a short one, and a long one is really meant to be a long one. Woo! That one's just... Man, there's so many good sounds. So, just when you need a destructive, which I'm sure you can come down here and shape and you can make less destructive, you know, less saturated, less destroyed. You know, shaped or destroyed in different ways, you know.
That's just a dirty. Good lord. There it is, a big. I've just been looking for that sound and it's just already made. Right here. That's, that's my favorite sounding one so far. Ramp down. I gotta remember that one. That's a good one. So many good kicks, man. Just banger after banger of kicks.
you can really test out how adding a little saturation, you know, how that really m makes it just come through, you know, just a little bit, add a touch like this, like that, and then add a little shaping after that. And a little number one shape, destruction. After that. So many good sounds. And on that note, until next time.